Dick D'Amelio has been coming to the Walmart in Seabrook for years, and he says today is the first time he's ever seen anything unusual happen here. The police were clearing everybody out, everybody out. A bomb scare and a report of a gunman in the store called into police. We all are out in the park a lot there. D'Amelio capturing the moments that upwards of 500 people were forced to evacuate the Walmart and surrounding businesses. I was, I was shocked. I mean, you really don't see that stuff around here, you know. It's it's just a crazy world. But the threats were quickly found to be hoaxes. We wound up opening the businesses. And just hours later, a suspect. Police arresting 38-year-old Megan Levitt of Alfred, Maine. Officers tracking her down after they say she made the calls on speakerphone while she was in an Uber. We were able to have someone from the public, an Uber driver, who witnessed um, the suspect in this case making the phone calls um, to the police department. Police say Levitt's boyfriend was about to be arrested at the Dick Sporting Goods across from the Walmart. She came over to try to um, distract us uh, from making that arrest. But when her Uber driver heard the conversation, he alerted police. We're thankful to him for um, sticking around and, and flagging us down and letting us know that was really a, a big piece of the investigation. Now, shoppers say they're grateful for that quick action so they can now feel safe going back into their otherwise quiet Walmart. Especially where they already got someone, like that's pretty comforting and like knowing that it was under control. And Levitt is expected to appear in court on Monday. Anyone with information about this case is asked to contact police. We're live in Seabrook tonight. Ariel Metropolis, WMUR News 9.